Hi everyone, Reno Nadiandi here and today I will share how to create 3D dripping effect in Canva. Go to Canva and I will just Instagram post 4 to 5 size and then I will add element. Upload your photo and I will add this photo. I will remove the background. I will increase the size and then I will add a drip element. You can type here drip in the graphic and I will choose this one I will put it here and then I will add a square increase the size to cover the woman now duplicate this page on the page 2 remove the woman photo and then add another square increase the size to cover all the square and the drip and then send it to back select the square change color to white and also the drip change color to white now download it as png page 2 only go back to page 1 and remove all the element but the woman and then upload the PNG of page 2 here remove the background now increase the size you can move it to the top like this and then crop it now select the woman and crop it like this and then select the frame and go to edit and then choose duo tone will change the color to the same color as the background which is white and the shadow also to white now download page 1 as png add a new page i'll change the background color to any color like as gradient and then upload the png here Use BG Remover to remove the white colors. Okay, and don't forget to go to Edit to upscale the image. I will choose the maximum. Click Upscale. Click Replace. Alright, now close it. I will increase the size and crop it. Now duplicate it. Go to Edit. Just dual tone, just custom, change the highlight to black, and then flip it horizontal. Go to position, layers, and sign it behind the yellow shirt, and then crop it. And then I will reduce the size like this. and crop it here add a shadow here i will choose this one reduce the size and place it here and you can also add a square and make it a border place it in the center and then remove the color and then add the border weight and change it to like this one okay and change color to white and then add a corner rounding all right so this is the tutorial if you like this video please share the link to your social media see you next video and have fun with canva